What is going on, guys? Welcome to a brand new video. We are here back at it again. Happy Thursday. Attack on Titan. We're here. Last on Attack on Titan. Titan. Tight. Last on Attack on Titan. We're on episode five. We're now on episode six. Last episode, we started the battle of trust and shit went down. I mean, Aaron is dead. I don't think he's dead, obviously. I don't think that's going to be the thing. And I, I just don't think that's a possibility here. But pretty much everybody died in his little uh, regiment, you know, which was, I mean, that whole sequence of them just running and fighting and shit was, was pretty badass. It was pretty badass. But it didn't go well at all. It didn't go well. So I wouldn't say it was badass. It was just more cool looking, I should say, I guess. Uh, but nonetheless, none the less, I'm excited because Mikasa, she had to move to a different regiment. So she has to uh, go deal with other shit while Aaron is seemed to be dead. And she kind of sensed that. She kind of knew, which could be interesting. So I don't know if there's something up with her or what it is, but that is exciting. Um, we learned stuff about, you know, Titans. They have a very hot temperature. Their heads regenerate. I mean, their I guess their whole body probably degen or, uh, regenerates. Um, if you if you desert your your command or what you're supposed to do, you are uh, punished by execution. So that's also one thing to keep an eye out on. You cannot leave, <laughs> even if you win, and everybody survives. You will probably still die. Um, the advance team, yeah, they died, and. Yeah, a lot of shit. Thomas died. Rest in peace, Thomas. Uh, Aaron's leg and arm are are shocked. So that's also one thing. Um, yeah, yeah. Let's get into Attack on Titan, episode six, season one. Let's get into it in three, two, one. Click. Oh yeah, and Aaron is not here. I fell asleep after stream. I got McDonald's. Fell asleep. And uh, I didn't wake up till a little bit ago, and I'm guessing he's asleep already. But we are here. Let's get a hold of that mouth. All right, come on, we gotta get out of here. Are you able to stand? It's like all the Titans just left. Jesus Christ. Food, you and your buddies crap out. Or maybe you've got some finances tucked away to fund the racket you call a job. Now shut up and push. This cargo's worth more than you people make in your whole lives. Nobody's getting out of here unless the wagon's in front. Uh, profit over people's lives. Wow. Oh, no. <laughs> what the fuck? He's running like that. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why is he running like that? <laughs> it's an abnormal. Oh, good shit, Mikasa. Jesus. Oh shit. Wagon out. Finally. Fucking asshole. It's uncalled for. Why do I have to suddenly think of you now? Huh. Scheduled to pay us a visit today. Maybe you could talk to him. <laughs> Speak of the devil. It's so eerie. Mr. Ackerman, it's Dr. Yeager. Is anyone there? Dad? What's wrong? Holy shit, what the fuck happened? Good 
for work. Aaron. Okay. Very interesting. We're lucky you're not the one we're selling to. Plenty of folks would pay a premium. She's exotic. What they used to call an oriental. You know. What the fuck? I don't want to hear it. You're just back again. Fine. <laughs> hey, let's not give me any attitude, all right? If you're feeling feisty, this is what you get. What the fuck? Who are these people? The last thing you'll ever see. What the hell do you think you're doing? Hey, little bastard, get back here! Oh, shit. Jeez. I mean, you can't go against it. He's right. And all of a sudden, I remembered. I'd seen it all before. Many. The world is a cruel place. Mm-hmm. And it's home. Fight! Fight! Tell me how to get home. That ought to keep you warm, right? The world's a cruel place. Goodness. You have to fight. That's it. We're done. Now scale the wall. I should help the vanguard withdraw, sir. Ackerman, wait! It's a cruel world. But I it looks like she's just trying to find Aaron. Aaron, as long as you're part of my life, I can fight to the bitter end. Damn. It was a very good episode. Yeah, that was a very good episode. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed Mikasa's backstory. I think that was very... Very well done, very cool. Um, I love the beginning with Armin, just shock. Just literally going through shock at what what he saw. And, I mean, it's terrifying, literally. That, that would be a traumatizing, terrifying experience. Um, we didn't see any Aaron besides young Aaron, which is really cool. And he killed those guys by saving Mikasa. And the Mikasa killed the other dude, and... I love just Aaron, like, fight. You have to fight. And then her realizing that this world is so cruel that they're in. Like, even killing animals. Like, you, you look at it like it's nothing, but that's another living life form. And you're just killing it for your own good, not, not that life form's own good. Now, I'm not, like, vegan or anything. I love my meats. I love shit like that. But I do understand, like, a morality part and why people don't eat certain things like i get that part i will make my own choice because i i it's fire i'm going to um but that's that's one thing um you got them the the people of the town or the that that part of the wall um trying to la leave and the, the the guy that leader dude or whoever that was was like no you guys realize how you know how much this is cost like how much this costs it's worth more than y'all's lives and it, i mean it's a good metaphor obviously in real life too that most rich ass like leaders just they care about profit more than a human life and it's true even in this it's true and then mikasa came in there literally was about to kill him and uh the guy was like okay we got to do something so they finally let the people out I love that the, the scene with the, the with the abnormal Titan just running. That shit was hilarious. I mean, uh, that's meme worthy shit right there. Um, that was really funny. And the faces just running back and forth like that. 
that's funny animation. Like the, it's not even I don't even think it's intended to be funny, but I find that shit hilarious. I don't know. Um yeah, we we learn more about Mikasa's backstory. You know, her parents died to these fucking weirdos and then they were going to sell them probably for some weird ass shit to some rich ass people to either run experiments on them or do disgusting things to them, which is awful. Um, we learn she's an oriental, which is a different kind of like species of human, like a subspecies of human kind of, and that's, that's kind of interesting. I knew she wasn't normal. There's something there. And I wonder if, I wonder if we'll learn more about that, but that's very, she's like half oriental because her, her father wasn't an oriental. That's why they killed him and they didn't want to kill the mother. But that dude killed her because she was crazy. It's like, no, you just walked in and killed the father. Of course, she's going to do that. Like, she's not crazy that like. What? <laughs> like criminals are so or like just bad people in general are so stupid. Um, yeah, and then young Aaron, he disregarded his father and was like, nope, I'm just going to go kill them and just goes kill them. He almost dies. But Mikasa you know, was like, yes, I will kill. <laughs> Aaron gave her that scarf. And Aaron, or, uh, Mikasa was like, I feel total control. Like, it was like how she is now, where she doesn't really have much emotion, but she cares about everybody, and she knows the right decision to make. She is very smart, battle-wise, just tactic-wise. Like, she's very, very smart. And she knows the, the right thing to do. Even if it means risking her life, she will risk her life for Aaron. Which, I wonder if it's just a brotherly-sister bond, or it's more than that? Like, I don't know. Like, obviously, they're not blood-related, so there's nothing wrong with them if they were to get to back together. But I don't know if what she feels is just a brotherly-brother-sister bond, or, like, if there's more to it. Like, she's had these feelings for a long time, and she cares a lot about them, and she, her, her debt is to Aaron because Aaron literally saved her. And uh, she told Aaron's mother that she would watch after him and make sure he's okay. So that's what she's doing right now. She is she's just trying to find Aaron. So I'm excited to get more into this arc. This is a pretty good arc. Um, and I don't mind the episodes being so short. I think it's a good, probably a good show to binge. I don't binge it. I just don't like binging. I, I would like watching shows in the way they were intended to. So like whenever shows release weekly, I just do that. Now, I don't mind binge-watching shows. Like, I'll binge-watch a couple. Like, if I'm not reacting to a show and I'm just watching it, I might binge a couple of episodes. But I'm not, like... Like, some people binge the whole show in, like, a day. And I'm like, no. That sounds awful. Then you're done with it. All you can do is just watch YouTube videos on it or think about it yourself. It's like, I like going episode to episode, maybe a couple days a week, especially if it's just on, like, a streaming service. I can be like, all right, I'm going to watch this episode and then wait maybe a day, two days, or wait a week. So I can let that episode hit me, and then boom, next episode, and you're like, holy shit, that was much worth, that was so worth the wait, oh my god! And then there's some episodes where you're like, wow, I can't believe I just waste, waited for that, that was dog shit. And give an example, like Lost. Lost has some of the greatest episodes of any television show, but then also has some of the worst episodes. Expose, Jack getting his ta tattoos, Shit like that, dog shit. <laughs> it's so bad. And there's a, I, I see. I'm a Lost season six enjoyer. I'm a Giga Chad in that sense because I enjoy Lost season six. I enjoy the finale. I think the finale is really good. I love the backstory on the island. I love all the flashback stuff. Richard. I love the purgatory theory that was going on in that season. There's a lot, but we're not even talking. I don't know why we're talking about Lost. Maybe because Lost is the greatest TV show of all time. Nonetheless, I like I said, I enjoyed this episode a lot. Very good stuff. I wonder what's going to go on with Armin, because Armin's freaking out. and I, I, I mean, obviously, Aaron's going to be alive, and Armin is going to freak out seeing Aaron. He's going to be like, I saw you die. How are you alive? You're not real, man. And it's going to be like that. But yeah, Mikasa's badass. She took out so many titans. See how many dead titans there were? And then, I, so I guess when they die, all the, like, their body just, like, disintegrates, it looked like. Their bodies weren't, like, like, their skin was gone. 
they just looked decomposed and dead. And that was pretty insane. I'm not going to lie. Pretty insane. But Mikasa's badass. I'm really... In she's, she's the character I'm kind of the most intrigued in. Her and Dr. Jaeger. I really want to know about Dr. Jaeger. I think Jaeger's a good... A good man. But I feel like there's something hidden and sus with him. Low-key. And my theory still is, is he's the one who created the Titans. That's my theory, and I'm going to be going with it. Be going with it. Or he created the Colossal Titan. He got a hand of a regular abnormal Titan, and he created the Colossal Titan, which is sentient and a literal god. And uh, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. But let me know what you guys thought of this episode of Attack on Titan. Rem reminder, every Thursday. And also... Always sunny in Philadelphia every Thursday. So I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you did, please like, favorite, subscribe, hit the not notification bell for new videos every single day. The Miss Marvel video did not get uploaded. It got blocked multiple times. And the video is like 13 minutes long. The episode was eh. I mean, the show's good, but I don't think it's worth it. So we'll wait till the finale to hopefully get a rea or, uh, the reaction up because I don't know why it got blocked. That shit's S. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed if you did. I already said all that. So, goodbye!